that opening scene on Hogwarts Legacy. Beautiful. What's up, guys? It's your boy Hercules, and well, we're back at it again. And I said it, it was gonna be probably my last Hogwarts video that I was gonna make. But to be very honest, this game is great. This game is fantastic. And I've only played, I wanna say, an hour into it. Because, well, I got work. I got, I still got work. So, but, whoa, this, this was just amazing. So, playing the very beginning, the opening scene, I created my character. I did this. I didn't want to go too crazy, make myself, but I just created a character that I would envision in the world of Harry Potter. And playing the little opening scene, the backstory that we're getting. It was incredible. I, I had a lot of fun. And then that opening scene where it, it starts off like in the Harry Potter movies. And gosh, dude, I started getting goosebumps. I started getting uh, I started getting the feeling of joy, man. Because look, I'm not the biggest Harry Potter fan out there. I know a little bit of Harry Potter here and there. I know a little bit of the, the story. But this this brought it back this made it incredible this made me want to watch the movies that as soon as i turned off the game i put the movie on i put the first harry potter and i started watching it and dude it feels incredible one thing i can say is that if the losers the cast losers the losers the cast don't want to return to the world of Harry Potter because of the uh, trans community. You don't need them. This story, just a little bit that I play this story, guarantees you can make more stories out of the wizard world. You can go back in time. You can go into the future. You can do whatever you want. It doesn't just have to be Harry Potter. The only character it could be of anybody else you can make hell you can take this story and make it into an actual movie and then just continue for a hundred years or whatever years you want to continue for it the beginning was incredible and i can only expect it to either be the same or get better and i still haven't even gotten to be able to explore everything. The gameplay is awesome. The acting is pretty good. The story is awesome. But we'll see what happens once we get down. I might do another video after I put in 10 hours and I get halfway to the story. I'll do another video of my 10 hour impression. But first hour impression, whoo! It's incredible, guys. I usually don't tell people, oh, don't play this, or uh, I recommend this. But this is one of those games that I gotta recommend. If you're not a Harry Potter fan, doesn't matter. This is one of those games you don't wanna miss. Either you wait until it's on sale, or you get it right now because you wanna play something right now until something else. And I've been making videos talking about, could this game, be game of the year or get nominated for game of the year i am putting my hand down right now that yes this game has the potential of getting nominated for game of the year even winning game of the year and that's with some heavy competition from spider-man 2 because we all know spider-man 2 is gonna be up there we all know that uh what's that game called uh zelda is gonna be up there but I think Hogwarts has an opportunity. How big of an opportunity? Well, we won't know because we have to wait until those other games come out and see how great they are. But we definitely know Zelda and Spider-Man are gonna be on that list. And Hogwarts, I'm having a lot of fun. I can't wait to jump back in it. And well, I think it has the opportunity to be game of the year. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like, make sure to subscribe, and I'll catch you guys next time.